hey everyone and welcome back to my channel to your taste today y'all i am going to show you how to make a shrimp salad sandwich and the ingredients you will need is some good rolls here so i have these um sub rolls here that i'm going to use also you would need a pound of shrimp that has been deshelled and deveined you need about half of an onion that's been diced. So I would say, depending on your taste, right? So if you don't want too much onion on it, you could go smaller, but I did half an onion. And I diced them up pretty small. And then you need two celery stalks that has been diced up. And these are small too as well. Look at that. That's how I did mine. But you can dice it however you want to. And the seasoning you would need is Obey seasoning. And this is for the shrimp and the Tony, your Creole seasonings. And I am using Tony's and you need some mayo. We're not going to use a lot of that. Maybe about five or six tablespoons. You just want it to be creamy, but you don't want it to look like a tuna salad or anything like that. And you need some oil. I'm using avocado oil because um, we're going to cook up our shrimp and season it. All right, so I'm just gonna move this out of the way and bring up my shrimp here. Bring it down a little bit. Let's see, two, yeah, okay. All right, so we're just gonna season it, like I said, with Tony's and Obey. So we put that in there. We're just gonna stir that up. Make sure all of it is covered in our seasonings. All right, so we got it all nice and covered. Oh, Lord, I think I'm about to sneeze. So look at that. Got it all nice and seasoned with the Obey and the Tony. So now we're going to head over to the stove. My cast iron skillet is preheating with about a tablespoon of oil. And let's get started cooking this. Okay, everyone, so now we're just going to add our shrimp to our skillet here. Spread it out a little bit. Okay, so I'm doing two batches. I have one here that I'm doing. And we're just going to cook these on both sides for about two to three minutes on both sides until they are pink and fully cooked. Alright everyone, the shrimp is done. So, cooked them up like this. All right, so these are fully done and seasoned. They taste really good. So we're going to head over. And first I'm going to... Um, toast my sandwich buns and my buns and then we're going to put the salad together okay so once your shrimp is done you're just gonna put it aside and let it come to room temperature um, before you assemble your salad all right so at this point I'm just gonna like I said toast my my rolls and then by the time I do that it should be done all right so our shrimp is ready we got our glass bowl here, and we're just gonna add our shrimp, and if there's juices, that's fine. And we're gonna add in our celery. And we're gonna add in our purple onions. And we're gonna add in the mayo, about a tablespoon at a time. So let's do well, I'm gonna do two tablespoons and see what it looks like. I may add more than that. All right, so we have tablespoon of, a tablespoon of mayo here. I want to bang it on a glass, and then we're gonna get another tablespoon, two tablespoons, and we're just going to mix that together. All right, so this is how it look with two tablespoons of mayo. I'm just gonna add just a little bit more to it. To make it a little bit more creamy and then also if y'all want to cut your shrimp in half you can cut it in half um, mine's a little small so I'm just gonna leave mine as they are all right so this is about I'll say about half of a tablespoon here let's put that in there and mix that up really well okay y'all 
we get it all nice and mixed up. I have my bun that I toasted on the inside too. And so you keep this as is. You can eat this on some crackers. You grab you grab you some lettuce um, leaves or cabbage leaves and put that in there as well. It's up to you. So I'm gonna just spoon this in here. Okay, we are done. I have added some of these chips to it. These lemon chips, y'all. These are good. This is probably the only. Actually, that is the only chip that I buy. Um, so these are done. Look at this. You got your chips on the side or fries if you want to or nothing at all. And look at that sandwich. Look at that. And you still have some left over. And then that's it, y'all. So this would be a delicious recipe for uh, your lunch, your dinner. Your family would love it. And it's easy to double it up. Oh, go lay down. Hold on, y'all. All right, so that's it, y'all, for the video. Try out this recipe. You can add some lettuce to it or tomatoes, which I think I may add to mine when I eat the remaining part of, of this shrimp salad. But it is delicious. It's tasty. It is flavorful. Easy to double. All right, so that's it for now. Make sure you like that. Like this video. Hit that like button. Thank you for watching. God bless and be safe. Bye.